আমার এখনো মনে আছে লাইক অনেক 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 বছর আমার লিটারেলি মানুষের গালি খেতে হয়েছে মানুষ বলতো কে এই ছেলেটা নতুন ছেলেটা কিচ্ছু বাজে ব্যবহারে না কেন এরে ঢুকাইছে রাসেল আলী রাসেল আলী জায়গায় থাকবে এ জায়গা কেউ নিতে পারবে না সাজ্জাদ ভাই সাজ্জাদ ভাই জায়গায় থাকবে সাজ্জাদ ভাই কে জায়গায় জায়গায় কেউ নিতে পারবে না ইন ও ইন ও অফিস ফ্যান্স সো অনেক কথা শুনতে হয়েছে ইন্টারনেটে অনেক গালি খেতে হয়েছে আমার কিন্তু আই হ্যাড টু ইউ নো বিলিভ ইন মাই সেলফ অ্যান্ড জাস্ট ইউ আই ওয়াজ ডুইং Hello guys, uh, welcome to another video. In this video, I am basically going to talk about war physics. I am going to talk about war physics. I am going to talk about war physics. Before we go into that, please subscribe to my YouTube channel so that I can bring you guys more videos, more weekly videos. Don't you guys want that? So let's begin! I think... I think it was late 2007 um, So Amar Jotaduk Moneyase I will try to go back in time and dig into the past and extract as much as I can. So Amar Jotaduk Moneyase um So first Komul Bhai Shate encounter Kibhabe Hai. So it was actually Komul Bhai, if you guys didn't know, Komul Bhai was the person who actually got me in Warface. Uh, so how did it begin in the first place? So what did I say? It was that Komal Bhai was the first chance to vibe through it. So I said that it was the story. So I said that it was the story clearly. Komal Bhai at the time he was releasing Underground 1, Underground 2 mixed album CDs. So Underground 2 was the offer uh, to release a song. Uh, so, Amra Ganta Banai, Amra Tahon, we kitchen Nam Ganta, or Trip to Pran, we Ganta Banai. Tahon Mune Viber album Shesh. Yes, Tahon Viber album already out, already released. I think th it's, it was in the same year Vibes album got released. So, Komal Bhai album er offer Ashlo, to Amra Ganta tick on time Shesh Kurte Barina. So, what happened was um, we couldn't finish the track on time and we couldn't deliver the song to Komal Bhai on time. So we decided that why not we go to Komal Bhai's house, one of us will go to Komal Bhai's house and we'll give him the song anyway. Even if he you know, doesn't take the song, we will just go as a courtesy because someone uh, respectful from our music industry asked for the song. So we should just go and say thank you to him at least, even if the song doesn't go. So Amar Munas, I think Sabin, Sabin was the one who went to Komal Bhai's house and uh, Sabin Komal Bhai Ganta Shunai. So Komal Bhai Ganta Shunai, I, Sabin, I'm, it, it, this is what Sabin told me uh, after coming back from Komal Bhai's house. Yeah. Komal Bhai, you solo te pause korse, pause kore jigesh korse, e chhele ta ke, e chhele ta jekhane solo baza chhe, chhele ta ke. Then Sabin ta ke bol se je, eh, eh, Komal Bhai eh, ta nama chhe, ani shi amade band lead guitarist. So that's, I think that was Komal Bhai's first encounter of me. That was for, that was the, I think Uwebe Komal Bhai heard my name for the first time. So, Tarpor, I think it was one day, I mean, uh, a guitar studio chilo. I'm not sure if it's still, I think it's called Dream Desk. So, I went to Dream Desk with, uh, uh, with Sajjad Bhai. Uh, Sajjad Bhai is the, uh, Sajjad Bhai was Dream Desk's producer at the time, back at the time, not anymore, I think, I'm not sure. So I went with him for some reason. I think I was working on a song for him. Tokun um, uh, Komal was there, and he was working on some. Um, he was working on some mixed albums, I think. Komal just came out of the studio saying he's very hungry, and he needs to go and eat somewhere. So I think it was me who uh, asked Komal Bhai that Komal Bhai, it's my birthday. So why didn't you come to my house because my mom cooked lots of dishes today. I think this is a perfect time for you to come to my house and you know get a nice treat. So why didn't you come over and surprisingly he said yes and he came with me. We, I clearly remember that we sat on the same rickshaw and we rickshaw the kore amra amar basha aslam ami komal bhai ke rickshaw bolte silam je komal bhai 
it's such an honor for me to be sitting right next to you. I mean, I can't express my feelings. Goldberg said, it's okay, kid. It's okay. No worries. Don't worry. So where's your house? I mean, he didn't say that literally, but I bet that's what he was thinking in his head. So one day, what happened? I met Goldberg. It was my birthday, by the way. What a gift. So, what happened? One day, dream desk. I am like, hey, it is called Bhai. Then I am like, invite Kurnal Bhai. Right, right. And I was hungry. And he was hungry. He didn't even care. The best part was, he didn't even care who I was her kid. It's just he was hungry. He needs to eat. And I am like all happy. Kurnal Bhai was like sitting right next to me. We got around a Riki, right? And I was like telling him, it's like an honor for me. You're sitting right next to me. And he was like, Whatever. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> that attitude. So anyway, we came to our house. I vividly remember we went in my room and I mean our Purano Akta Ibanez Chilo J Ibanez the Ami Viber first album Puratakuri. It was a RG seven seventy X, I think I'm not sure about the name. So we Purano Ibanez git at a bear column back take it. And then uh Purano Akta Bangachura amp Purano Akta Processor, shop baker, call by Shamli Debul and call by. This is what I have, um, and this is what I play with. Call by just uh, smiled at me and he said, uh, Kid, I've been through the same thing. I, I, I used to have a shit guitar as well, and it's nothing, it's okay. Let's let's play. And that's when I played some of Vibe songs. I played some of my own songs, some Vibe songs, and that's where Call by got to see me for the first time. And the first thing that Komal Bhai told me that day was, you remind me of Russell Ali. And uh, I was blown away. I just kept the guitar down as quickly as I could and I, and I said, Komal Bhai, keep all this in your Thank you so much. Now I was only a bulloje, Komal Bhai, I mean, Jabutu, Ajay Bajay 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 And he started playing, I was like, oh my God. <laughs> I hope he doesn't ask for the uh, food bill. <laughs> How many times did I, did I thank you? Oh, yeah. you were yeah. like, no, he was a very nice, polite kid. So, Tarpore actually, um, uh, by, uh, Tipu asked me, you know, they need a guitar player. And I said, okay, you know, on is the man. Uh, till today, and I think I will never ever forget that compliment coming from him. So, that was the beginning. And uh, right after that, I think. After that day, uh, one fine day, Komal Bhai just uh, called me up on the phone and asked me, Oni, why don't you come down to Bailey Road, uh, that's n near to my house, uh, at the pizza house or some somewhere, I can't remember now, uh, why don't you come over and have pizza with me? And, and I just went there straight. We had pizza together and that's where Komal Bhai popped the question, would you like to be Wolfes' new lead guitar player and play alongside with me? Yeah, so that was the day. That was the day I officially joined Warface without any audition. Yes, without any formal audition. That was Goldfire's um, approach and he asked me to join Warface and I was in Warface from the next day. Yeah, how cool was that? How cool was that? I mean, seriously. So now let me tell you guys the story uh, about my first few days in Warface, how it went. This is the interesting part because I'm a Mona as a first practice very guessy. I'm a Bhangachura Ibanez near and Bhangachura processor near, not to mention Bhangachura. Bhangachura. Yes. So uh, I'm a Mona as a I mean, in a very short time. And um, I think uh, I had a list of about 10 to 15 songs because Warface had a show coming at Uttura Club at the time and that was my first show with them and I had a huge list of songs to pick like from all the albums. So um, we, had, we, we were practicing every single day, I was listening to Warface's songs and I was trying to pick the songs with my ears as much as I could and some of the songs were shown by Komal Bhai himself I used to go to his house and he used to show me some of the songs how he played the solos and stuff so uh, but most uh, most of the stuff I tried picking with my ears and uh, then I remember uh, first few practice sessions practice it practice better guessy right 
আমার মনে আছে যখন প্র্যাকটিস স্টার্ট হয়েছে সবার কথাবার্তা না আমার মাথার উপর দিয়ে যাচ্ছিল চিনো ওয়াই বিকজ দে ওয়ার অল টকিং ইন মিউজিক জার্গেন্স লাইক কোনো ভেন্ট লাইক এফ শপ মাইনাস সেভেন সমস্ত ভেবেন লাইক নো নো এফ শপ মাইনাস সেভেন লেট ইবি সি শপ মাইনাস ডমিনেন্ট ফ্রিজিয়েন্ট ব্লা 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 এন্ড অল দ্যাক অল দ্যাট স্টাফ সো এভরিথিং ওয়াজ গোয়িং ওভার মাই হেড এন্ড আমি তো সেলফ টক মিউজিশিয়ান আমার আমার গ্রামার এন্ড মিউজিক্যাল জার্গেন্স ইউ নো দোজ স্কেল নেমস কোর্ড নেমস আমার খুব একটা চেনা ছিল না ওয়াজ ওয়াজ নট ফ্যামিলিয়ার উইথ দেম অ্যাট দ্য টাইম আই থিঙ্ক ইভেন নাও এনিওয়ে সো সব মাথার উপর দিয়ে যাচ্ছিলো ওরা যখন জ্যাম জ্যামিং জ্যামিং সেশনে সবাই কথা বলতেছিল অ্যান্ড ইউ নো দে ওয়ার জাস্ট দে ওয়ার জাস্ট হ্যাভিং এ ফ্রি স্টাইল জ্যামিং তখন সব কিছু আমার মাথার উপর দিয়ে যাচ্ছিল কিন্তু তারপর আস্তে 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 না আই আই স্টার্ট ইট গেটিং ইউজ টু দে ওয়ে অফ প্র্যাকটিসিং অ্যান্ড অ্যান্ড অবভিয়াসলি আই স্টার্ট ইট প্র্যাকটিসিং লাইক ইভেন মোর আওয়ার্স দেন আই দেন আই ইউজ টু সো আই ওয়াজ ক্যাচিং আপ কোয়াইট ফাস্ট আই থিঙ্ক ইয়ে সো তারপরে আমরা প্র্যাকটিস শুরু করলাম আমার সামনে ইউজুয়ালি থাকতো একটা একটা কোর্ড শিট কারণ ওয়াফিসে গানে কিন্তু অনেক কোর্ডস ইফ ইউ নো আই মিন ইফ ইফ ইউর এ গিটার প্লেয়ার ইউ ইউ উড নো অনেক অনেক কোর্ডস তো আমার সামনে লিটারেলি একটা কোর্ড শিট থাকতো আমি কোর্ড শিটটা দেখে গিটার বাজাতাম লিটারেলি ইভেন অন মাই ফার্স্ট ফার্স্ট শো ইভেন অন মাই ফার্স্ট শো আই হ্যাভ দ্য কোর্ড শিট ইন ফ্রন্ট অফ মি অ্যান্ড আই আই উড ফলো দ্য কোর্ডস অ্যান্ড প্লে বিকজ আই কুডেন রিমেম্বার টোয়েন্টি সংস ইন one week that's that's impossible but i had to i mean most of the stuff i think 75% of the stuff i just winged it on stage just i uh, improvised yeah so um the day came uh, it was our first show at uh, uttara club uh i don't have any videos unfortunately um Uh, we played about 20 songs. I think it was a long show. It was a typical Warface gig. Like, uh, I think Warface performed for two hours. We had a break in the middle, but then it was like uh, one hour, then a break, and then another hour. So we played many songs. And we had, that was the day we had our first ever guitar battle, Komal Dhai and me. And uh, I don't know what happened to me that day. I mean, I somehow felt I belonged to this band. I mean, I felt like it was my band. Do you know what I mean? I mean, I felt like I was playing for this band for a long time. I was born to be with this band. And everything just happened magically. Like, I wasn't forcing myself. No one wasn't telling me what to do. I was just in the zone. So Kongolbe and I had, we had a guitar battle that day. It was incredible. I think it was the best moment of, one of, my, one of the best moments of my life and one of the best guitar battles we've ever had in the history of our career together. Yeah, I wish I had a video. I wish there was a video on YouTube or someone had the video. Yeah, but that was Uttara Club's show and that was, that was historical for me. That was, that was the first time, that was my first gig with Warface and from there on uh, everything started becoming pretty easy uh, as, we, as we went on practicing and uh, performing on stage and we used to perform a lot, like we had a show almost every week. And we can't think in a vibe downfall shuru hai, because vibe show korto na, vibe band member most of the time they were busy with their studies and I was mostly busy with music than my studies. I, I think I was studying at NSU at the time and I dropped out, yeah. I just dropped out from NSU and I started concentrating more on music because I mean I thought I found my path. I, 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 uh, this, is, this, this is the band that can take me to 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 far places and uh, they encouraged me a lot i still remember called by all the band members of the band they all they always encouraged me a lot i, I still remember these few lines from gold i used to tell me like kid you used to play for many underground bands before but now you're with a bigger league yes so welcome welcome to the new league and stuff like that and used to encourage me a lot gold by and ami amra amra onek 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 close chilam you know and amra onek kichu amra even ekshathe ekta tar bashay tar room e ghumaiche ek bed e amar ekhono mone ache oi story je kol hai machkhane ekta kol bali sheke bolo ke we do not cross this boundary i still remember we used to have so much fun together inside the band and outside so 
আস্তে আস্তে না ওইখান থেকে আমরা অনেক শো করা শুরু করলাম তারপরে ভাইব ডিসব্যান্ডেড হয়ে গেল সবাই দেশে বাইরে চলে গেল আমি অফিসে ফোকাস করা শুরু করলাম আমাদের শো অনেক বেশি আসা শুরু হইলো আমরা পথচলা রিলিজ করলাম তারপরে সত্য তারপরে আমাদের প্রচুর শো ছিল সো ওইভাবে আমাদের জার্নি শুরু হইলো অ্যান্ড আই বিকেম এ পার্ট অফ অফিস আমার এখনও মনে আছে লাইক অনেক 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 বছর আমার লিটারেলি মানুষের গালি খেতে হয়েছে মানুষ বলতো কে এই ছেলেটা নতুন ছেলেটা কিচ্ছু বাজে ব্যবহার না কেন এরা ঢুকাইছে রাসেল আলী রাসেল আলী জায়গায় থাকবে এ জায়গায় কেউ নিতে পারবে না সাজ্জাদ ভাই সাজ্জাদ ভাই জায়গায় থাকবে সাজ্জাদ ভাই কে আগে জায়গায় কেউ নিতে পারবে না ইউ নো ও ইউ নো অফিস ফ্যান্স সো অনেক কথা শুনতে হয়েছে ইন্টারনেটে অনেক গালি খেতে হয়েছে আমার কিন্তু আই হ্যাড টু ইউ নো বিলিভ ইন মাই সেলফ অ্যান্ড জাস্ট ডু আই ওয়াজ ডুইং অ্যান্ড আই নিউ ওয়ান ডে ইউ নো আই মিন দিস উইল অল দিস অ্যাপিয়ার ইয়ে and i will win their hearts and i did hopefully later <laughs> so that that's the story so i'm i'm an actor chotto actor tip thakbe at the end of the video i want to share with you guys that is um manush onek kichui bolbe you know manush internet e onek kichui bole don't wait for their feedbacks you know you you're not you don't make music for them you do music for yourself it's your passion tikna so do music for yourself forget what the internet saying you know don't look for anything just just be yourself and chok bondho kore dorja bondho kore practice every single day tumi jodi practice thik moto koro na shobar mukh emni bondho hoye jabe you don't have to worry what people are thinking or saying just tumi tomar kaj koro just you know have a have a tunnel vision and just practice you know and you you will always succeed you know আমি আমি একটা জিনিস সবসময় ফলো করি কনসিস্টেন্সি অ্যান্ড ডেডিকেশন ইফ ইউ ইফ ইউ কনসিস্টেন্ট অ্যান্ড ইফ ইউ ডেডিকেটেড নাথিং ক্যান স্টপ ইউ রাইট অ্যান্ড ওয়াফ ইজ ফ্যান্স আই লাভ ইউ গাই স্টিল আই উইল অলওয়েজ লাভ ইউ গাইস অ্যান্ড আই স্টিল সি ওয়াফ ইজ আজ মাই ওন ব্যান্ড ডোট বি ডিসঅ্যাপয়েন্টেড জাস্ট বিকজ আই এম নট প্লেইং উইথ এম এনি মোর ওকে হোপফুলি ওয়ান ডে আই উইল আই উইল কাম ব্যাক হোপফুলি ওয়ান ডে ইউল সি মি এগেন অন দ্যাট স্টেজ অ্যান্ড আই can't tell you how 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 grateful how 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 much i owe this band you know i'm i mean onek kichu shikhi e band e kas theke ami amar composition sense onek develop hoyse because of this band ami onek kichu shikhi komol bhai kas theke komol bhai bajano dekhe you know i mean the whole war phase experience actually made me i think i would say uh, you know made me the oni hasan i am today so i owe war phase a lot So that's that's my short story and then let me know what you would like to see next. Yes. Bye bye. I'll see you guys on my next video. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.